Over the last few months, I've been testing out a lot of different website builders. I recently came across Framer.com, a no-code website designer tool that lets you create stunning websites with animations and it's all really simple to use. Framer actually works together really well with Figma. If you have experience with Figma, then this should be really easy for you to use. But if you are a beginner, is this a really easy tool to use? Well, let's find out. If we head over to the Framer app, we can start designing our website. It is now massively pushing its AI features and let me create a website with AI for you just to show you what that looks like. I enter in my prompt and now it will generate a whole AI powered website with just one prompt. Now this is the marketing website that it has created with just one prompt. It is pretty basic as you can see. I would love to see some more color themes going on. I like that it has added like some kind of emojis in there but it's still pretty basic. So let me just start a new template and let me show you how this works. If you click on the top left corner, you can go to file and then you click, click on new or you can click on new from template. Framer already has a bunch of cool templates out there that you can use as the base for your website. For example, if you want a personal blog, then you can use this template. You can customize it a little bit and you already have everything in there without needing to code, without needing to do anything. For example, if you have a software as a service, then you can use this template and this already has everything in there and you don't need to code anything. You don't need to do anything at all. You can just change these things and you already have your own website. And this looks pretty cool. Let me just preview it for you. So it has the animations in there. It has even pop-ups. It has slide ups. So overall, this looks pretty cool. This is something that you can create within Framer, but are you actually able to create something like this in Framer? Well, that depends on your skill level. If you want to get started out, then your website in the beginning will look something like this. This is something I really quickly created just to show you how this works. You have a go to nav bar, you have a hero section with a background in there, and then you have these templates that you can choose from. Then over here, you can add some things like this, and then you also add like a contact page. Well, all of these sections are from Framer. If you want to use them, you click on insert, you go to sections. And then as you can see, all of these sections are pre-made and they are ready to use for you. If you need a specific page for your website, for example, a blog, then you can just click on this add page and then you have this blog page. Then you can add like an article in there. You have a sidebar, project page, anything that you'd like. They already have templates for you that you can easily customize, but the great thing about this is that they have already have like animations, coding, all of that. It's all in there. So you don't need to do any of that. But in order to go from a standard website like this to something like this, then you need to have some skills. You need to dive deeper into how Frame works. You might even need some experience with Figma and all of this requires some time. So with all of that said, let's head over to the pricing. You can get started with Framer for free. And if you want a bit more of an advanced website, then you need to have at least the basic version or the pro version. If you want to get a discount, then check out the discount code in the description down below. But is Framer actually worth it? Well, I think it is. If you spend some time in learning Framer, then you can build some really cool websites where you can have custom animations in there. You can even start from templates. You can buy templates. You have all of these cool pop-ups and the best thing is you don't have to do any coding. You can even use Framer to build websites for your clients. So it's definitely a tool that's worth mentioning in terms of the website builders. If you want to check out other website builders, then check out this video and I will see you in the next one.